the holder of the meadow. Go to the very center of the forest, closest to the one place of which you have the fondest memories. As you approach it, you will see a shining ray of sunlight brighten the darkest, thickest brush in the forest. The brush will part to reveal a clearing just large enough for you to sit in. Slowly enter the opening, just quiet enough to not disturb the wildlife, and sit, legs crossed, in the center. When you sit, close your eyes. If you open them, it will be the last time you ever do. You will see a woman with bright red hair and golden honey eyes take your very soul from you. You will lay there, emotionless, for the rest of eternity. But if you keep your eyes closed, you will see, in your head, a horrific tale. Many have gone mad after seeing this tale, while others have taken their own life. Only a few have lived to see it in its entirety. It's of a young, short, brown-haired girl sitting in what seems to be the exact spot you are in. It seems as if the girl is waiting, or as if she's lonely. You can hear children laughing in the distance. The girl will look up, with beautiful blue eyes, put a flower in her hair, and skip off. As she jokingly hides behind a wide oak tree, she will come back around with a steak knife through her heart and a locket in her hand. You must watch the little girl die, so you can never forget her face. Once the child is dead, immediately open your eyes, so you are not tempted to take the locket. If you open your eyes, and there is no locket in your hands, get up and walk out of the forest. Take your time, for you have nothing to fear. If you open your eyes and feel a locket intertwined with your fingers, you must sit in that spot and try your hardest to think about your childhood. Think of your face and compare it to the little girl's face. While thinking, you should hope that no one else will read this passage. That locket is object 555 of the 2538. Guard it with your life.